friends. Today we're trying to do a speed build because we're trying to get a whole bunch of stuff done and one of the things that has to be done first is Bull needs to move. Well, Bull's tank is currently a wee bit empty and I've got some big plans for it including... Hi Lexi! Hi. This background is going in. So, first step is cutting the background and uh, then we got to make sure that we drill out the uh, ventilation holes and adhering it to the back of the tank. So we're going to get set up and figure out how to do this. Every millimeter of cut is being judged. Cool. <gasps> dun dun dun! <laughs> I don't want to get anything I got on the ground. Okay, so we just want kind of the, yeah, this wood bit at the top corner. Handy dandy scraper McJigger. middle is nicely adhered. Now the careful work. Thank <laughs> you. 
with the light on it, the silicone kind of shows through, but a little bit. But as it dries, it should disappear. Yep. Yeah. Looking good. Cabin wall. Yeah, right? I think that's pretty nice. Not too bad. Good job. Now that the background is in, Lexi is setting up the substrate. Okay, I've got Lexi drilling some holes because we're going to hang a little hanging basket in there. Clever girl she is. She uh, added a drop of white paint to each of the hanging spots, stuck it up against where we kind of want it to hang down from. Now she's drilled some holes in there, and, and we get to put paint. our hangers. Nice. Three hangers. Turns out the vice grips worked better than the uh, the drill for that, but they're in. Okay. Next step: attaching the thing and seeing if it fits, or seeing if it uh, stays up. So these, unfortunately, they're very tough, so you can't bend them by hand. They have to be bent with this shit. Don't do that in this family. Yeah. I mean, do I need them closed? Might even be better to have them open, open so I can remove it. If you need to. It's in! It's up! We did it! And it's pretty strong. We win! All right, next step, maybe the log pile. So this is what we're at so far. Do you feel like you're out in the cabin yet? Maybe you've come in, take your shoes off, stay a while. <laughs> I'm thinking one upright and one on its side, like they took them off and one just fell down. Exactly. See, you can hang out, take your shoes off. There'll be a water dish. There'll be uh, the actual water dish that we want to use. Uh, it's going to be temporarily unavailable until we get it set up. So uh, we're just going to use a little metal water dish at the moment. And yeah, this is going to be his new home, Cabin by the Woods. We'll get it, uh, get the lights hooked up, and then. Uh, Substrate in, move them in. Should be fun. Yes. Make it a mess. No, I took the scoop. There you go. You want the scoop? Sure. Faster mess. Or behind the cabin, the cabin could come forward some, and he could have his quick still. Or just yeah, in the corner somewhere there. Looking good.
That's why I want to give it to him. I don't want yeah, to take it from him. We are looking good. Uh, water dish. We'll put some water in, and then we'll get the start of the show. Who wants to kill me at the moment? Yay! Killing! Okay, one thing we still have to do is we have to cut through from the back into the ventilation holes. So we're going to do that right away and, uh, and then it should be ready for him. So we'll do that and be back to set him up. Okay, lights are on. Everything is set up. Let's do a quick walkthrough. We've got our winter wood pile. We've got our cute little log cabin planter. We did bring in his cork bark hide that he loves so much. We've got our raised planter with some marble pothos in it. We've got someone's boots that they took off as they went into the cabin. And then we just have a little dog dish that they've left out for Rover. So I will set up the camera. We'll bring him in and hopefully I don't get bitten on the way to get him. I'm glad I got that on camera, buddy. <laughs> uh, you can bite the camera. That's what I was figuring. There's a reason I don't uh, handle bull very often. He is very food interested. Can I have my camera back? Yes, this is good. It's mine now. No, you can't actually eat that. He's really wanting to eat it. He's trying very hard. He's trying to find the head to figure out where to eat from. How would you go explore your new tank? Like tied himself in a knot. Look at him. Yeah. Literally threw himself. Oh, you're funny. You're a funny snake. I'll add a picture. 
can't eat the camera. You can't eat the phone. You can't eat any of it. <laughs> He's a good critter, eh? And have some real interesting smells, actual firewood. It's probably had mice all over it. <laughs> you just stay in the tank, okay? Don't cause any problems. But he's good at causing problems. It's okay, if he tries to come out, we'll just pop him with your flip-flop and then he can eat that instead. Sure, that would <sighs> be great. Do. Find a place to eat. You can't eat that. It's not food. He's a hungry, hungry snake. Don't fall. Why don't you go back inside the tank? Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Trying to eat it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bull. Oh, bull. You're so cute. him to uh, to explore his new abode. Oh. Eat the tank. Good job us. <laughs>